Okay guys, on this one, you're basically making a carrot out of a round coil of clay. So once you get your coil, the idea is you wanna taper the end of your coil. So only rolling on one side of your coil to taper that end. And then you're just gonna round up the thicker part of your coil. And the idea here is we wanna kinda of put it on the table in such a way where we flatten out one side of the coil. It's gonna make it more comfortable to hold in your hand than if it was a completely round coil. I'm adding water so when it bends, it doesn't crack. And then I gently start forming it into something that kind of looks like a question mark. Thinking it's gonna to attach to the side of my mug. So I wanna make sure it's gonna attach. Things look good. And then I'm just gonna use my four attachment steps to make sure it attaches on the side of the mug. And there you go. That's the question mark one. Okay guys, next handle style. This one's very simple. We're just gonna use the table to flatten only one side of our coil. So the bottom side of the coil is flat and the top side remains round. We're gonna put some water on there so when we bend it, it's gonna bend without cracking. This time we're shaping it into something that looks like the front side of the capital letter D. We're gonna go ahead and use our four attachment steps to prepare the handle that's ready to go onto your mug. And I'm kind of flattening out the front of it to be almost like, almost a square handle in some ways. All right guys, here's our last coil that we're gonna to learn together as a class. This one starts as a round coil like the other ones, and this time we're flattening both the top and the bottom. We wanna keep the sides kinda of rounded cause it's just gonna be more comfortable. Put a little water on there before we bend. And this time we're bending it to almost look like an ear shape. And then trimming, because remember we're going to be attaching it to the side of our cylinder. That's what it's going to look like. It's a really nice handle. Again, really comfortable for the hand to hold and really attractive on the side of your mug. Thanks, guys.